A family is remembering their loved one for the many good deeds he did. Matthew Miller died after a construction accident in Jackson Tuesday. 12 News' Tal Ta spoke with his family and has more on the good and faithful person they describe. Tal? That's right. Loved ones said Matthew Miller had a heart of a servant. The Mississippian worked for his family's construction company that bear the names of him and his siblings. When on Tuesday, Miller died on the job when the ground beneath him caved in, authorities say, and the coroner ruled his death asphyxiation. Matthew Miller was surely loved by his family, who say they want him to be remembered more than from his death. Put some stuff down. Can I read it? Mm -hmm. right. Matthew was the kindest person I knew. He was always thinking about others. My daughter Miles loved Bluebell bullet popsicles. I opened the door. It was not one or two, but three big boxes of Bluebell bullet popsicles for Miles. Gathered by his mother and father, siblings, cousins, along with grandmother, the 33 year old described by loved ones as a fun loving jokester and overall simple man. He gave you advice whether you wanted it or not. <laughs> We would send videos all the time of dump trucks and tractors. Family members say Matthew was at peace with his life. He died on Tuesday while working on a project on Livingston Road. His father, William, recovering his son's body. It was just one of those things and he was probably going over there to just check and make sure there wasn't anything unsafe for anybody else. The tremendous loss of a young man who would give the shirt off his back, they say. It was full of mischief, but I mean, it was good mischief. And he didn't even really care if they appreciated it. It just made him feel better to know that he was helping somebody. The love and memories they have of Matthew will be cherished forever. So many other people that God said, you've done enough, Matthew. You've done your job. It's time to come home. Now, Matthew loved, to, among many things, college football, watching it, talking about it, playing with his dogs, hunting, and just playing practical jokes on people. Walt.